start New Year's e Day, New Year's Eve, New Year's Day off with a walk. Sounds like a plan to me, don't you think? Exercise, it's a good thing, good way to start the day. I'll be back. Hey guys, a little bit of New Year's Day rearranging. I do really, really want a new, bigger table, um, but in the meantime, it was past time to move things around and make it more open. I put the ironing board and iron away. I don't need it out all the time. And when I do need it out, it's easy enough to pull out. It's in the closet back there. Um, so are you ready? You know, yesterday I did that sitting corner. Hold on, let me turn okay, you on. I moved the stencils over here and we'll move slowly. I don't want to make anybody dizzy. We move this little table. My sister calls it my little altar table. Anyway, we moved it here with some artwork. I now have a chair in the window. I can sit and read and drink some tea. Love that idea. Got some books on the floor, some books on this footstool on a tray. Love that. That didn't change. Paperwork I have to finish. Um, Use one of my Ikea carts over here, which is great because when I am painting, I can pull it out over here and it's next to me rather than having to like spin like a top to get things, which I feel like I'm doing sometimes when I'm painting. Didn't change, didn't change, didn't change. I did reconfigure the table. There you go. So I had these white shelves on either end, short end of the table. I moved them to the back, moved everything off the table to the back, cleaned out a few things. Um, I only have on the table what's the next project I need to work on, which is swatching the alcohol markers I was sent. I also had another Ikea cart that was in Bob's office um, that he was just using with random stuff on it. And I put all the other things that I want out to use when I'm journaling that I don't want to put away on the Ikea cart, which like the other one, I can wheel around to where I'm working, work on my journal, when I'm done, put everything back in the cart and wheel it back over here. If I stand back, look at all this open floor space. I do still want a bigger table because I mean, I can fit it in the room, but this will work, and this is much more open, I think. What do you think? Let me know in the comments down below. I'll be back. Everybody, it's about 10.30 a.m. Monday morning, January 2nd. Bob has today off, and then he goes back to work tomorrow. Um, so I think that we're going to try to get the rest of the Christmas decorations inside down today. Um, we're also going to go for a drive somewhere and get some steps in. Um, we might venture into Portland, which we haven't done often since COVID started, um, and maybe go to Pioneer Square. I don't think we've been there since COVID started. If we have, it's only been like one time. So we're going to go do that today. Go on a little adventure. Um, hold on I to put second. you down because my arm was sore or yeah, anyway. And then my dad called. So um, yeah, Bob and I have decided too that we're going to continue our um, healthy journey and we have gained a couple pounds back um, over between Hawaii and Christmas. Um, so for me, I'm going to be um, really controlling my snacking. Like I have a problem with snacking. Um, drinking more bone broth. Of course, being as active as possible. The weather's still kind of weird outside. We could go walk in the neighborhood regardless or go over to the gym, but I think we're going to go for a drive and go walking around downtown, as I said earlier. So I think we're going to try that instead and um, get some steps in. And then we have to come home and do some chores, uh, mainly taking down Christmas decorations. So um, we're gonna do that today. I'm just up here. I also have a crap ton of video editing to do because I've got to, I have 48 hours basically to get the vlog edited and then post it to YouTube for this week. So and I have three weeks for a uh, full eclipse to, to edit for that. So <laughs> it's gonna be interesting. 
So anyway, but I need to do that before I film the Ohuhu videos. And I have some ideas for that. So um, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do that. Um, it's a lot, but I have to, but I have time, and it'll keep me from snacking. So it's all good. And I love the new setup of the art room. It's really 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 working for me. So anyway. All right, that's it for the minute. I'll be back. Tuesday morning, January 3rd, 10, 14 a.m. That took almost three hours, but we have the end of 2022 vlog edited and rendering. It is gonna be a little bit of a long one. It's 43 minutes and change. I did edit out as much as I can. I do think I need to make a separate video for my plain air urban sketching equipment that I built over the holiday. Um, so that will be something I will do that will be shared over in Patreon. So if you want to see that, please think about joining my Patreon. It helps support the free content here on YouTube um, besides all the other stuff. Anyway, um, I'm going to let the computer do its thing. I'm going to go make myself a cup of bone broth and then I'm, I think I'm going to sit up here in my new reading nook and um, read or watch um, YouTube on my iPad while the computer does its job and then I continue editing because I'm not done yet. Ugh. Okay, <sighs> one thing at a time. Plus I forgot to write a daily post for my Facebook group yesterday. Um, I, I should say weekly post. Um, I completely forgot all about it, so I guess I should do that too at some point today. Oops. I'll be back. Video editing is done. Things are loaded. Did I mess anything up in the editing process? Probably. <laughs> uh, but anyway, um, two of the videos are loading to the main channel. One is for the Patreon, Patreon channel. Um, so I'll load that one up when the other is done. And then I still have to write social media posts, which is still haven't done yet. But I'm gonna let the computer do its thing. I also realized I forgot to print any calendars for my planner for YouTube and stuff for 2023. So um, good thing it's only a couple days into the new year, right? So I guess I better do that. First, I'm gonna grab my lunch though and sit back in my chair upstairs, which is my new favorite spot and under my blanket and um, let the computer do its job before I task it with doing anything else while I eat my lunch. And yeah. All right. I'll be back in a second. Good morning, everybody. Do I look like a hot mess? Uh, it's because it's, well, it's 8 o'clock in the morning, but I haven't showered or anything yet. I've been up since just after 6 a.m. Bob had to get up at the crack of dawn um, to go to the courthouse because he has jury duty. So he's sitting over at the courthouse waiting to see if his name and number get called. Um, those of you who've been on jury duty before know the process. So anyway, <sighs> he's texting me on and off. Um, <clears throat> he had a little bit of a fever again yesterday, but I think it broke last night. I am coughing again today, but I have no fever. I have a sore, little bit of a sore throat, but again, no fever. Um, because I'm asthmatic and have like 5 million tons of allergies, it's not that uncommon. And unless I get a fever, I'm not going to worry about it too much. But I am taking some meds and I'm drinking plenty of fluids. And it could be an allergic reaction to something I got for Christmas. Um, so I'm going to stop using that and go back to what I was using and see if it clears it up. Because that's a possibility. We've got video to film today and stuff. I don't have a car, so I'm not going anywhere. I may go for a walk later, but... 
we'll just see how I feel and what the weather does. So I'll be back. I'm stalling and sitting in the corner with my tea, my new favorite spot. I need to get some filming done. I'm gonna go grab some bone broth, take a restroom break and all of that stuff. And then we'll start working on the alcohol markers. I'll be okay, you know what? It's a miracle I got that video filmed. I don't know if it's gonna be one or two at this point, but I got it done. Uh, alcohol marker video. And um, yeah, my phone kept dinging. I got a phone call from the husband, like, stuff just kept happening. It is raining cats and dogs outside, as they say, like, massive amounts of rain. I haven't had lunch yet. I don't know what time it is. <laughs> I, know. I don't know. Oh, it's almost two o'clock. <laughs> I guess I should eat something. Ah, uh, maybe make some more tea. So, anyway. Video is done, it's in the can as they say. I'll edit it maybe tomorrow, I'm not gonna do it today. I'm gonna make myself some lunch, I'm gonna clean up my mess. I know you can't see my face, it's dark in the hallway. <sighs> anyway, I'm going to be done with that for the day <sighs> and go relax. I'll be Good morning back. everybody, it's 9.50 a.m. January 5th, I think, Thursday. Um, I don't know if I mentioned it or not, but Bob and I have the coughing cold flu thing again. I don't have a fever like last time, but I want to cough and hack up a lung. And because I'm evidently congested because I'm sleeping with my mouth open and I'm waking up in the morning with a sore throat. I feel like the beginning stages of when I had my workplace injury that caused my asthma. Anyway, cough medicine, cough drops, all on board. Anyway, good morning everybody. Yes, Mr. Bob and I are still not feeling well, but we're getting better slowly. I am on sertraline, AKA Zoloft. And so that means that I can't take any over the counter cold medicine because there's drug interaction issues. So I did send a message to my doctor last night asking him what I can take. Is he gonna reply today at some point and say, why don't you come in? Probably. <laughs> um, if but- that happens, we should both go in at the same time. What he said. Yeah. Um, because we both have it and we're both not feeling well and we both have had it twice now and we're sick and tired of being sick and tired. I'm sick and tired of the clogged nose 
Yeah. The sore throat. Yeah, and we have the same primary care physician, so we probably should just go do that. So the one day spike in temperature. Yeah, he on. keeps getting a fever. Yeah, so anyway, um, so that's fun. <laughs> Which means I haven't had any energy to do anything. I do have video to edit, but I'll see if I can get it done today in between answering emails and waiting for the flooring people because, you know, it's a hurry up and wait situation. <laughs> yep, can we forget that for it to get done? Yeah, so hopefully it'll be done soon. Anyway, that's it for the minute. I'll nice. be back. All right. Yes, we're in the car. Um, because I'm on an antidepressant, I have to be careful what kind of cold medicine, among other things that I take. And um, I got a little dizzy taking the Robitussin. So I just went and talked to the pharmacy. She said, really, you can take anything, but you might notice some mild side effects like dizziness and stuff like that with some of them. I said, okay. She did say I could take um, like Tylenol cold and the Rite Aid has a generic one that's identical. Uh, the um, ingredients are identical and so, I got that. So hopefully that alleviates some of the wanting to cough, the mucus, and the sore throat. <sighs> hopefully. Um, it's just for daytime though. They were pretty low. I mean, everybody's really low in stock on stuff. So I'll have to just do without at night, but that's okay. <laughs> uh, anyway. <coughs> We're gonna do another COVID test um, later this afternoon. Cause yeah, I don't. We've already done one and it was negative. Don't expect it to be positive. But anyway, let's go home. The floor should be finished in Bob's office. I can't wait to show y'all his completed office when the desk is in and everything. Um, it'll be a little bit, but. Uh, well, um, as long as he doesn't have COVID, he's still going to California to see his mom. And while he's gone, I'm going to paint the frame on his bulletin board black because he would like it to be black. So we'll do that while he's gone. And yeah, we both have an appointment with our doctor on Wednesday because of this cold thing that keeps coming back. Whether we're better or not, we will have a telehealth appointment with him. And yeah, a lot of traffic, holy cow. All right, I'll be back. Um, I'm feeling a bit better, but I sound worse today. Um, at least when I start coughing, I sound worse. Anyway, um, Bob, of course, is feeling better and he's on his way to California. We won't have a conversation about whether I think he should be going or not, but anyway. It is Saturday morning. It is just before 10 a.m. I'm sitting in the parking lot by Union Gospel Thrift. I need to get some, I need to sh start shopping for some bits and pieces for the upcoming baby shower for my grandson to be. Um, we're gonna have, she's gonna have two baby showers. One's gonna be at my house. And so I'm gonna pop in here this morning really quick on my way back home and see if I can start acquiring some parts and pieces for party favors and stuff like that. And then we're gonna go home and I really, really, really need more coffee and some breakfast, because that's a thing. I'll be back. It's 6.58 p.m. What did I do today? A whole lot of nothing. I sat here on the couch, I napped on the couch, I watched a couple of movies, I'm drinking some tea and just doing some self-care. I really need that. I am going to do a little bit of drawing in a minute. I'm going to find a movie or something to watch and do some drawing. Um, but yeah, I just need to get better. And I am sounding more sick, um, at least when I'm in the midst of a coughing attack and that sort of thing. But I think it's because instead of all the mucus dripping down the back, it's coming out the front. I know that's gross and probably TMI, but anyway... So I hope that's a good sign. I still don't have a fever, so I don't know. Anyway, I'm just sitting here in the quiet watching my tablet because I don't turn on the big TV when Bob's not here. It's a thing. Anyway, uh, it's been a good week. Uh, I hope you guys have had, despite being sick, it's been a good week. Uh, we are making progress on Bob's office. I am loving the new rearrangement of the art room. I can't tell you how happy I am with that. I started... 
I don't know if you can kind of see it over there in the background. I started shopping for the daughter's baby shower. Um, we're doing a high tea theme. So anyway, it's going to be a lot of fun. And uh, they're going to use it. It's going to be at my house and Jenny is helping me plan it. I'm going to help her with thrifting some teacups and stuff for the party as party favors. So anyway, I'll show you guys what we do with all that stuff when the time comes. Anyway, that's it for now. I hope you guys have all had a good week. Don't forget to please like, share, and subscribe. If you'd like to support my art and the free content here on YouTube, I would love it if you join Patreon. I do have one. I do have a few things still listed up on Etsy. I'm always posting and sharing artwork and paintings. They're always for sale. So if you've seen something on my socials that you thought, wow, that's really great, and you would like to buy it, DM me and ask me how much because, you know, if it's available, it's yours. Uh, anyway, that's it. Leave questions, comments, or concerns down below. Check out the video description for Patreon and all that other, all the other links and stuff. And uh, go out and have a good day. Have a good week. Do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. I'll see you next week. Bye, guys.